What up, Loudly on the mic. Welcome to Sly Cooper Thieves in Town. Let me turn my TV down because I'm not going to get feedback. But y'all, welcome to a new series. Sly Cooper. I've been playing this a lot lately. I was like, you know what? Let's make a gameplay. See? I told you. That's the first one. Second one. Hey, check out y'all. Try hard. <laughs> uh, yeah. That was pretty, that was kind of a loud intro. <laughs> How y'all doing today? Man, heck yeah, I want the full story. But yeah, how y'all doing today? You know what I'm saying? I'm doing beautiful. Yo, these loaded screens are gonna be, uh, you know, pretty hectic. You know, it's all good. It's Sly Cooper, cuz. It's Sly Cooper, cuz. It's Sly Cooper, homie. Yo, you a buster, homie. No? Yo, did y'all hear that, that the only way Sly 5 can happen, because if you saw the, you saw the, you know, the, at the end of the credits, there's a secret ending. If you, the only way Sly 5 can happen is if, he, is if we all go to Sony and tell Sony, tell Sansaru Games, make Sly 5. And I'm kind of hoping they've been doing that. I really do. I want my Sly 5, and I want to see how it all ended. Yeah. I should probably just start at the beginning. The name's Sly. Sly Cooper, and I'm a thief. From a long line of thieves. In fact, thieving is the family business. And business was good. Although, until recently, I considered myself retired. Having hung up my mask and cane, I was enjoying life on the other side of the law. In the company of a certain lovely Interpol <clears throat> agent named Carmelita Fox. Hey, baby. She and I had a history, which generally involved her trying to lock yeah, me up. Handcuffs ready. So I should mention our current situation was only possible because she thought I had amnesia. I didn't. It was great to finally enjoy each other's company without a shock pistol being involved, and we quickly put the past behind us. But as time went on, the old itch came back, and I knew I needed to pull a heist. I should also mention that as a master thief, I only steal from other thieves. So it took me a while, but I finally found what I was looking for. My target was an upstart art mogul, a real hotshot collector. He seemed respectable, had even opened a new museum. But I could smell a rat. Reliable sources told me he was dealing in black market antiques worth millions. So I felt he should share the wealth. I was working on a plan when one night, as if on cue, Bentley showed up. Bentley was the brains of our operation, the mastermind. We grew up in the same orphanage where we bonded over stealing cookies, our very first heist. And we've been best friends and partners ever since. We hadn't seen each other for a while, but I knew immediately that something was up. Bentley had been enjoying his time off too, building a new lab from scratch with his girlfriend and fellow tech whiz, Penelope. She had joined the team on our last game. And the two of them had really hit it off. I'm sorry, but. Apparently, I mean, they she just looks finished her little animation secret look cute, project you know, nah. when Penelope had simply vanished. I forget her, bro. She a thotty. Bentley was worried sick. He searched frantically, but found nothing. Then, he noticed something that completely stunned him. In his spare time, Bentley had been researching the Thievius Raccoonus, the Master Thieves' handbook passed down through the Cooper family for generations. Its pages overflowing with the exploits and secret techniques of my esteemed ancestors. Only now, those pages weren't so full. In fact, they were disappearing right before Bentley's eyes. Realizing there was no time to waste, he gathered his gear and raced off to Paris. So... Wag! Yeah, but since itself is disappearing from the book, don't you think Sly would disappear first? The first I mean, thing Bentley kinda. did was track down Not Murray, first, the know. third in our trio. Murray was our enforcer, the muscle, and the guy who'd eaten all the cookies we stole back in our orphanage days. Get a piece. Through the years, the three of us have become an unbeatable team. 
and we were more like a family now than a gang. Murray had been living his dream on the pro driving circuit, where his van had become famous, or rather infamous, for all the crashes he'd caused. Eventually, he was unable to find a sponsor due to his high insurance premiums, and he moved into Demolition Derby, where he remained undefeated. When Bentley showed up, however, Murray dropped everything to help out. Especially when Bentley explained that his van was the key to the whole plan. With Carmelita distracted by a new assignment, I took the opportunity to slip away and met up with the guys at our old Paris hideout. Bentley launched into one of his elaborate presentations, and I saw the whole scary picture. Someone, or something, was literally erasing Cooper history. Then, to our amazement, Bentley revealed that he already had the solution. Time travel. It turns out his top secret project was constructing a time machine. And now, he modified the design to fit into Murray's van. We were going to travel back in time, stop those responsible, and fix the damage they'd done. Bentley explained the only catch was that in order to travel to a particular time, the machine required an object from that era. We knew from the changes to the Thievius Raccoonus that our first stop was feudal Japan. So here we were, about to steal a priceless 17th century samurai dagger from the same museum I'd been casing. Funny how things work out sometimes. Yup, y'all yeah, like Murray though. Murray's the homie, bro, I swear. <sighs> Sensaru Games Incorporated. Okay, you both huh. remember the plan, right? Of course! My mind is like a steel cap! Uh, that's trap, big guy. And everybody relax. We've been over it a million times. What could possibly go wrong? Famous last words. Look, we're only gonna get one shot at this, so we can't mess up! All right, no messing up allowed. Now stop worrying. This is gonna be a piece of cake. I'll see you both inside. Now let's get yep. going. Yes. Yes, I know my bad. <laughs> Real quick, let's go into the settings. I need to switch the up and oh, sorry, inverted. Okay. Uh huh. Mm. What? Okay, I see. Yeah, got a little slide popping, huh? Oh yeah, Peter. Yo, y'all, this really hit me, y'all. Not, well, not just now, but it hit me, y'all. Like, think about it. They said they're not gonna continue slide unless, unless. Unless we, unless us, the fans, hit up Sony and let them know. Okay, okay. So we hit up Sony and ask, so we need a new slide. I don't have to mention you can jump using the X button. Why? Don't forget you can double jump. Just jump, then press the X button again while you're still in the air. Right. Just another one of my many talents. First of all, video games break stuff. Hey, yeah, y'all. You know they talking about we need to talk. We need to uh, hit Sony up and let them know we need, we need to make it. Why can't y'all just make it? Y'all say y'all love Sly so much. They just said that. They said that on the interview. They said we love Sly. We would really like to continue. So continue it. Gosh, bro, I hate people like that. They just, they just ask for attention, man. <laughs> I'm lying. I, I'm lying. I, I can't. Okay. 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 Bentley. Bentley. Let me move. Please. It's perfect for peeking around corners. Press the circle button while jumping to interact with blue. 
I'm gonna be getting these coins, bro. I got to. I remember. You play Sly, you already love dude. I think I can handle that. And also, I was playing my uh, other one off camera. So I don't want to play. I don't want to start. So I, I have to be a little fast to catch me, bro. Well, when I was playing, I got like a ton of coins. You know, it was like this. You know. <gasps> it just helped me when you need, when you need to buy everything. Hey, Bentley. Was truck surfing part of Murray's entrance strategy? Ooh. Of course not. Murray's approach route is through the back alleys. Why do you ask? Uh, no reason. Anyway, it looks like he's in position now. Bro, hey, my back is been itching like all day. Fly. You can't risk going down to street level right now. Not a problem, Stop, Bentley. The good thing for us to stay above the action anyway. Yeah. Be sneaky with it. Looks like the perfect night for a heist. I turn the camera. <laughs> I'm trying to turn the camera. Like over here stuff. I'm already at. Like, I'm almost already at 100. That's ridiculous. Usually, like on this, because I have like, the slot collection. I got like a couple, Whoa. Weeks, a couple weeks ago. I got the slot, uh, slot collection. And the map. I'm the map. I'm the map. I'm the map. Oh my god, my back sticky. Yeah, I got this like the slide collection like uh, a couple weeks back, which made me want to play this. Go back, come back to this. I'm kind of glad they, they switched it up. I got tired of recording this. Him moving to but yeah, the slide collection from PS2 days. That joint. I'll be a ghost. I promise. Sure feels good to be back in business. Like the slide collection on those games, it's like so hard to reach. Like you know, because you get to buy um, power ups for them. It's like hella hard to reach it. To reach like price. My computer's going dead. That was too close. Oh, this ain't a day during my session. Messed up, boy. Yeah. Yo, y'all, it just hit me again. It just hit me again. It didn't make slide five. It's slide five. No. So it didn't make slide five. And then the new Ratchet and Clank that's coming out. See, I told you it would be a piece of cake. I'm trying to be quiet about this. Hey, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, I'm gonna say it. Well, oh. guess I'm a little out of practice. Do you say something, Sly? Uh, no. All good here, Bentley. Okay, it looks like you're going to have to find another way up. Use that ledge to move around to the front of the museum uh -huh. and stay out of that security light. I know, I Bentley, it's that. obvious. Oh. But yeah, as I was saying, if they continue slide the and they finish slide off, place. pause. Oh, I didn't have it. I couldn't do the slam? Oh, okay. Yeah, they finish slide off, pause. And, they, and then Rash and Clank comes back. Because the new, uh, some gameplay is dropped for uh, Clank. And uh, he's got like some little platforming going on, which looks absolutely fun and gorgeous because the graphics and the gameplay, new gameplay, new stuff like that. If that goes down and Sly Five comes out, then finally might make Jack Four, because we all know we need Jack Four. We need it. There are villains. The second guy. The second guy is like so annoying. I don't know. Like. He's like a cool villain, but he's just so annoying. Like, it's just not. It's, uh, I don't dig the ego maniacs. He's a douchebag. <laughs> yeah, we can finally get Jack 4, y'all. Because Jack and next to the Lost Frontier are so trash. Like, why was Jack fighting so much, bro? He never fights in cutscenes. He's like. He looks like. That, that game looked just like Nathan Drake. I don't know why. It just did. And here comes the first secret. Not really first secret. You know, over here. Where's that? There it is. Oh. No, I don't. Thank you. Oh! 
<laughs> that scared the fudge out of me. <laughs> Gosh. Am I getting the mask though? I don't know. But yeah, I don't know why. This slide forward is uh, Jack and Dexter Lost Frontier. It's really reminding me. Oh my gosh. It really reminded me of Nathan Drake. I don't know why. Man, nah, not uh, not really. Not really. Let me stop playing. I don't know. I guess because with his like little his attire and through the whole game, when he was wearing up through the whole game. I don't know. Like he was fighting through his cutscene. He had a staff. It wasn't really, you know. Like, oh my god, I did it again. Fudge, I'm just going for what you call it. Let's give me these coins, though. They're gonna come in handy, I'm, I'm telling y'all. Okay. It sure looks like somebody spent a fortune on this place. I already got a of surprises what they have that? inside. <laughs> Oh yeah, it, wait, yeah, that game was trash. Uh, I, I, I looked up, I looked up Sly Five, and it was this fan fiction, and I was reading it, and it really like, it, it, it had me, it, it had me intrigued. It had me intrigued, but uh, as I was looking that up, some about Jack and Dexter came up, and it said that they uh, they were thinking about, they were in development of it, but. Careful now. The yeah. skylight we want, but it's locked. My instruments are showing that guard has a move slowly until you're right behind him. When you're close enough, press the circle button to pick his pocket. You might have to. I was already rushed up heavy, Billy. Go. To perform a stealth slam, sneak up on a great fly. Now use the key to unlock weird. the skylight. The slam always looked weird. It always did. But what was that? Oh yeah, that's right. Jack and Dexter. They were talking about it. I mean, though, they were developing it, but it got canceled. I think, I think because of uh, Last of Us, maybe? Nah, I doubt it. I doubt it. I doubt it. I doubt it. Excuse the sniffing, but I, I don't know. I'm not sure. Either way, I just hope they bring it back. Like, everything but Lost Frontier is cool. Jack and Jack 1 through 3... Combat racing was fun. Okay, Bentley, Lost I'm in Frontier? place. Uh -uh. Let me know when up. you shut down the security system. Uh -oh. Patience, Sly. Uh -oh. You can't rush greatness, uh -oh. and I'm about to code Here come a boy. masterpiece. Here come my boy. I Bentley, too. <laughs> Bentley's the home. 